Hey everyone, how's it going? And welcome back to the forest. So, I've decided to come back, had a few updates, some tree sap, some new building stuff, and I'm setting myself with the task of building a kind of camp resort. And I've got a spawn which is right on a hill, which is really good. It means I can kind of chop logs down and they're going to roll into one place, so that speeds up the building process quite a bit. Which is decent, so I'm just getting all the shit off the plane, the pedometer and stuff that I never use. And uh, it looks a lot better, it looks like it's kind of been tweaked and refined recently. Uh, which is decent, very good. But you can now build bonfires and there's a second type of treehouse, it's the alpine treehouse. Uh, rabbit cages, obviously still in. Uh, rabbit traps are the new one. And I think you can build like paths and stuff, which I might not get into today, maybe at another time. Because, uh, you know, pathing's not my forte, but I'll try and build something pretty cool today. I'm uh, just going to chop down a shitload of logs before I even start building, just so I've got a decent amount of kind of stockpile just to build whatever I want with. I think this area doesn't have a lot of sticks in, which could be a bit of a problem, as you do have to trek around looking for stray ones on the floor or that the plane's kicked up when it's crashed, but nevertheless, still pretty decent. It's just crack on deforesting. There's now deer and raccoons as well, so I'm going to try and kill the shit out of them and eat some deer and eat some raccoon, along with rabbit and komodo dragon or lizard or whatever the hell it is. Um, but I'm going to put this temporary shelter here, try and build this as just a little save space. And then uh, just get cracking with building the two tree houses. Just chasing my first raccoon around. Try and kill this fucker. There's fucking loads on this. It's like a nature reserve. How did I just miss that? Jesus Christ. And fucking. I know I've only just picked up the fire axe, uh, the flight axe for the first time, but you know, fucking dreadful. If you miss from that far with an axe, you might as well just kill yourself. So um, I've been titting around. Cutting up some logs, picking up some sticks, just throwing them down this hill. And uh, I'm just going to continue with this. I think you need, I think it's around 40 logs, maybe 30 something, for the Alpine Treehouse. And I think the plan is, is to actually build two across from each other. One slightly up the hill and one further down the hill on the flat bit. And um, then I've got a kind of view of both ways of the kind of valley thing that's around me. Oh, there's a fucking deer as well. To try and kill him. Oh, there's two deer? Jesus Christ. A pack of deer? A flock of deer? I'm not too sure. I don't know the, uh, the plural term for them, so. Not the plural term, the collective term? I'm not going to get into literacy now, anyway. So, yeah, I've been chopping down quite a bit, and I am really, really impressed at how sharp this looks recently. Um, I did used to make kind of series on this, where it was. Bit more kind of role play, trying to you know kind of string a few things together. But as it keeps getting updated and wiping the saves, it's fairly redundant doing that at the moment. So for the time being, at least, I'm going to keep doing these kind of almost showcases and um, just do a bit of exploration as well on top of that. But I'm going to keep building and uh, hopefully, hopefully, don't get killed by like one of them tentacle bitches or something. I've put the foundations in place for the Alpine Treehouse, the first one. I'm just finishing this shit off, so there we go. Uh, oh. Right, this could be a bit of a problem. Um, I've built it going downhill as planned. And I don't think I can reach the stairs. It's just or access it from underneath, which is a fucking problem. Um, shit. Right, okay, so note to self, don't build a treehouse on a slope, because you can't fucking climb upstairs. Oh, that's really shit. It took me quite a while as well, getting the logs and sticks together, especially the sticks that you need for it, for the little fencing bit at the top. But, I suppose I'll just crack on building the second. Maybe can have one just for cosmetic value, um, just to look a bit... Decent, I don't know, maybe, fuck knows. So I built one slightly further down the hill, which is going to take me probably a similar amount of time, if I'm lucky. The uh, lack of sticks is a major problem. I'm having to go further and further afield to pick up sticks. Just try and kill this fucker. Fuck off. They're fucking quick, them raccoons, like. 
Um, but yeah, I'm having to go further afield, basically. I'm right by the coast, just on a kind of cliff top as well. So, yeah, bit of a shame. But still got a decent amount of logs. And uh, get started building this second treehouse. Or second alpine treehouse. It's not the end of the first night. And I've managed to finish the working alpine treehouse. So this is the second one. And uh, yeah, it's took me all day to build two pretty good tree houses. One of them that I can't get in, so it's maybe not as good. Shitload of tree shit in the way there. Um, I should probably build these on taller trees so you don't have like the kind of leaves in your face when you're doing stuff. But I need to build something else. Uh, probably some of the new stuff. Uh, I'm not going to build another tree house. Not yet, anyway. There's rock holders. The usual wall stuff. Uh, the usual stair stuff. Defensive spikes, so I'll probably build some of them. Um, they're probably more effective than walls. Wooden path. Gazebo. All right, I'll probably try and build a gazebo. I'm not too sure what effect that's going to have on me for to help me survive. But, you know, for decorative effect, why not have a gazebo? Drying rack as well. Shitload of sticks needed for that. So that could be a bit of a pain in the arse. The usual non-working boats. So I'm going to go down and start building a fire and a gazebo and then uh, get some sleep. It's now morning of day two, the morning of day two rather, and I'm just building the gazebo and defensive spikes. Got attacked in the night and had to kill two of them I think, put the fire and grilled some lizard. So I'm all pretty good to go at the moment. And uh, I'm just building these up as they only need logs and then I'm going to have to find some sticks. I think about 60 sticks is it for the gazebo there's a shitload of sticks that I need anyway uh, which is a huge colossal pain in the fucking arse you know especially when there's no fucking sticks around but I'm not too sure how well these defensive traps are going to work or these defensive spikes obviously if you built like a wall of them around um, I think that would be pretty pretty good I don't know if they actually hurt the cannibals or just maybe block them or deter them from coming into your base but you know it's fine they look fucking cool as well uh, pretty normandy not that like normandy was cool or anything like that but um is it normandy beach the beach omaha beach that doesn't matter um but yeah you know it looks pretty good the gazebo looks pretty shit actually i'm, I'm not too sure why i'm wasting my time building it but now I've started, I've kind of got to finish building it. It's going to have absolutely no benefit at all, uh, other than to, you know, chill out. And I think you'd only build that in a kind of survival situation if you were just kind of bored and maybe content about staying where you are with all these fucking cannibals and technical bitches and stuff like that. But, there you go, the defensive stuff's finished. It doesn't seem to hurt me when I walk right through it, because I'm fucking Houdini. But, um... Yeah, need to get some sticks. Finish off this gazebo and then just start building some other stuff like the rabbit trap. Believe it or not, it's now another day later and it's took me this long to find the amount of sticks that I need. So there we go. Gazebo's now up and massively disappointing for the amount of work that it took. But, you know, that's fine. What can you do? And, uh, yeah. So, you know, great fun really. Fucking gazebo, two tree houses, crush plane, little shitty fire. And, uh, yeah, all good, really. So, what have we got here? What else can we build? Um, rabbit trap. Okay, so I think if we place this maybe on the top of the hill away from the base so we're not scaring the rabbits away, and uh, that should be all good. And again, it's just a shitload of sticks. The amount of deer is just ridiculous. Just like they're constantly around. I didn't actually kill one before, but you can't harvest any meat or hide or anything off it, which is a bit of a shame. But there seems to be a decent amount of sticks around there. I don't know where these have appeared from. Maybe the deer are guiding me to sticks. Maybe the deer are my friend. And uh, I just killed one of them for absolutely no fucking reason whatsoever. But yeah, a bit of a shame you can't get a decent amount of meat off them. Um... Like, you know, venison steaks or whatever. I think they're deer anyway. I hope they're deer. I just sound like a fucking prize dunce, but, you know, that's fine. And, uh, 
Shit, no, it's not morning at all. I thought it was morning. Did I sleep in the day? Okay, right, it's getting to night time, so... It's, uh... It's night time, not morning. So, I might as well get some more sleep after I've eaten this lizard. And then, I'm going to build a bonfire tomorrow as well. I know this is kind of very buildy-buildy and not a lot of action, but... Just thought I'd showcase some of the new stuff to you guys. So I've just been woken up in the middle of the night by this annoying prick. And I'm going to make some molotovs and burn him to death, because no one interrupts my beauty sleep, you know. It's just the way it is, so... Let's just get three of them, because I'm a pretty bad shot. Fucking rabbit joining the dead lizards there. Let's try... How the fuck I moved? It was a dreadful shot anyway. Let's wait for him to come back. Fucking there we go. Fuck off. Right, so he's going to burn to death. He has actually just walked through the disp defensive spikes. Dispensive? Defensive spikes. And uh, yeah, pretty good. So I'm going to go back to sleep. Does look pretty good with all the fire and stuff like that. And uh, probably build a bonfire in the morning. I've woken up to more knobheads in my base. So same applies as last night. I'd prefer to burn them to death because, you know, it's just more fun. And, uh, yeah. So, just going to crush some Molotovs. I found a decent amount of booze and cloth in the stray suitcases that I dropped out of the plane. Out of the cargo hold. So, it's just three should do again. Uh, might as well do the fourth, actually. Right, so where are they? Well, there's one. Kind of ones with like black grey face paint on now. There we go, that one's fucking dead. Oh, they've all caught on fire on one. What a clever bunch. What a clever bunch. <laughs> oh no, this one's still alive. And it looks like his penis is on fire as he's running around. Maybe that's why he's running around. I got fucking blood all over me. Which is fine. Um, oh, I'm with a gynecologist right there, so. Uh, where is he? Let's go down and fucking leather this guy. I haven't got any more booze to make Molotovs, as I've just chucked four. I only thought I chucked three, but there you go. Maybe I was kind of getting carried away in the moment. Oh, uh, clever guy's also burnt himself to death on a extremely visible fire. Got like a shared IQ, this tribe of about three. Not going to be a mentor anytime soon. Okay, so let's just chop this prick up. I'm not going to make an effigy. I kind of like them coming into the base at the moment. Collecting the teeth, collecting the limbs. And uh, maybe when the tentacle ones come, I'll build some big effigies. But I can't see that happening anytime soon. Not for a few weeks, anyway. But what the fuck is this? So this is the guy's weapon I've just picked up off him. And uh, it's basically a skull with a hair plait and some hands wired towards it. I mean, you know... Never mind being extremely clever. They are extremely autistic as well. Can't knock down trees with this, obviously. Unless the girl had a really sharp nose. Well, it looks like it's got some spikes or something clipped to the front of it. But I'll Try and kill a rabbit with this. It's pretty weird. Let's jab a rabbit. Like. Oh, okay, that was fucking weird. Like, clubbed it to death. At least with the axe, it's sudden. With that, it's, uh, it's not. So I need to finish off this rabbit trap and find some sticks but I'm gonna have to voyage out yet again just finished building my rabbit trap not yet to catch anything in there and I think I want to build a bonfire it's the last thing to build today I'm not gonna bother with paths because building them on a hill we all saw how the treehouse went before so that would be a really shitty idea I'm just gonna get some logs together I haven't had any more aggro since then four or five guys or three guys came down before, the one at night and then the other three, so four guys, there you go, general mathematics, and um, there is a camp I think just over the hill in front of me where I was there, and uh, so I assume the aggro will intensify at some stage, probably over the next few weeks, um, if I survive that long, which I severely doubt, or don't end up in the caves, but hopefully this bonfire will kick off a shitload of heat, and uh a shitload of like flames and make everything look fucking brilliant like some kind of spire from Game of Thrones or something 
But uh, no, my building skills, it'll probably be really, really shit. But the blueprint looks pretty cool, looks pretty tall. Try not to burn myself on my own fire after ridiculing that cannibal for doing so before. But well, just need to collect some logs, get some shit together. I think I need sticks for this as well, which is a proper pain in the arse yet again. I don't understand why there can't just be sticks around there, or you can't just like like make sticks out of logs. I know it doesn't make any sense, but you should be able to make like planks out of logs. Maybe be able to build some kind of saw or something like that. That'd be pretty good. You can build, I don't know, yeah, maybe find like a blade or... I don't know, make it out of bones or something weird like that, but, you know, it is all coming along. The additions are pretty good. Still no multiplayer, which is uh, a bit of a pain in the arse. I think this would be really fun, on at least co-op with two people. I'm not saying I think, you know, like 20 people running around the map just being dickheads would be a good idea, but I think co-op would be very good, and maybe if you started in different parts of the plane, then that would be pretty good, and you had to find each other and stuff. My rabbit trap seems to have been flattened, but there's nothing in there. So. Oh, shit, my trap. Fucking hell. I thought I trapped myself in my own trap then. Ah, uh, the irony and stupidity of doing so. There's a rabbit. Oh shit, there's a raccoon. Fucking get in. Right, I finally killed everything. Magical. Right, there we go. You can't eat the raccoon meat either. It's a bit of a shame. Pretty pointless death. Killing him for sport and just practicing with my axe, but, you know. What can you do? So I'm just looking for some stuff. I need another stick for the bonfire. So just search around to see if the cannibals that I killed earlier have left anything. Uh, so let's just take a look. There seems to be some teeth. Not too sure what you can use them for, but we'll collect them anyway. No harm in collecting a shitload of teeth for absolutely no reason. Well, let's just go put the stick on here and see this magical bonfire. Ah, oh, wow. That looks fucking dreadful. Well, where's the flame? It should be... Uh, okay. Alright, that looks really shit. I thought it was going to be... Oh, no, right, okay. Or is that just burning the leaves? Um, can you even... Can you cook in there? I take it you can cook in that. But, yeah. Uh, I thought it would be like a huge bonfire, you know, with flames like 10 foot high, but oh well, what can you do? So, it's just, oh shit! Oh, it's a raccoon. I thought it was going to be a rabbit, for fuck's sake. I'm going to kill him anyway. Fucking stab him through the fucking, there you go. Fuck off. I mess with my traps there for rabbits only. Fucking bastard. So now I've killed two raccoons, built some pretty good stuff today. And, uh, yeah, it looks pretty good the resort, so I'll continue working on this, maybe wall it off. There aren't a lot of trees, uh, I've chopped a lot of them down, but that's what it takes to build a shitty gazebo and one working treehouse and a crap bonfire and a rabbit trap. Then, you know, that's what it takes. But I'm going to leave that lizard alone, it was a dreadful swing. But, thanks for watching guys, I'll be back with some more forest soon, preferably when it gets updated, and I will see you then.